Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody guys, let's update our review on the gold market. So yesterday we suggested that market probably should show the upward continuation. At least it was looking really uh, strong and overall performance was uh, positive. We, we, we had some signs that market uh, probably will continue move higher and indeed that has happened. But currently it really could be seen on the market that uh, the sellers step in around 15 to 20 area so market is moving high but this action has become slower and it definitely you could see what the struggle stands around this area so it's definitely sellers use this level for taking the short positions you could see it easily if you will take a look at the intraday charts now i'll show you a bit later on the daily chart currently we do not see something really suspicious so upward action flag bullish flag passion like continuation page the market right now stands around its upper upper uh, border or something that's sort of trying to show the breakout out of this flag so currently we do not see something yes we, we, we would prefer to see some strong upward continuation here with the big upper candle breaking of this 1520 area but currently we do not have it at the same time we do not see fast return and drop back down to the lows so if we will see it, well, that will be not very good sign. But currently, when the market stumbling stands around previous top, well, it keeps a bullish setup valid. Uh, maybe it's not good time for taking new longs position, but currently, if you have the longs, as we have discussed yesterday, we still could keep them. On the four-hour time frame chart, take a look what's going on. Yesterday market indeed has challenged this top, so that was very good performance, 15-16 area. These low uh, tops have been taken out and recall what we talked about. By this upper direction market erased this A, B, C top pattern. So we don't have it anymore because market creates the new point with what stands above the C and we can't talk about more extended targets of the same pattern. From that standpoint, it looks bullish. And uh, since market has formed here is also gradually cheaper to buy, we see not just minor reaction, but we see attempt of the high continuation. And here, guys, you could see the struggle. What's really is going on? Take a look. Very uh, choppy price action, deep retracements, overlapping candles, long shadows. This is uh, the, this price behavior shows that currently the positions very fast changing their arms. So sellers step in bulls trying to absorb these positions, uh, buying them, uh, which leads to some deep retracement and pullbacks. But at the same time, take a look, uh, market gradually is stubbornly moving higher. So creating the high lows in this reaction, it means that the bullish power currently is still sufficient to absorb the seller positions and uh, market trying to continue move to the upside. Uh, speaking on the valuable patience, guys, here we could get the bullish grabber. This candle hasn't closed yet, but uh, if we will get it, it will mean that market will take it out of the stop. If this will happen, there's really big chances that market will reach the COP. This is near standing our target, 1524, with this major A, B, C bottom pattern, which stands about the major resistance. If it will be broken, some stop orders probably will be triggered, and we could see some further acceleration here. So that will be the crucial moment, guys. If grabber will be formed and it will work, that will be the victory for the bulls. Um, that actually what we could keep an eye on. This is the reason why I suggest that we still could keep long positions. Just tighten your stops and uh, maybe diminish your position, grab some profit if you would like to, if you do not risk the all position currently. Uh, but this really could happen. At the same time, it, uh, it is a bit risky to step in with the new position because well, you could rely on the grabber purely, but um, well, it's difficult to. It's it's a bit risky, so uh, it's not enough context for taking the new position. Although, well, if if only taking some not really big uh, position where it stops right below the lows of the grabber and rely totally on the grabber, well, maybe 
you could try to risk this. Uh, speaking about the uh, erasing of the setup and the overall destruction of the upper reaction wall, here we need to consider this hourly chart. Uh, market actually stands with this gradual upper reaction. We have another patch adherence, minor A, B, C, D, with the OP at 1519. So it this create an agreement with the previous top and with the FIB level. So we expect that market should hit it. But suddenly, if market would drop below these lows, below the C point, breaking this tendency, and it means that the bulls failed the game. Again, the bears here. So you can see this a lot of struggle stands in this uh, consolidation, but bulls currently is dominating. If we will see the breakout, this will be capital, uh, uh, capitulation of the bulls, and this will be the bears step in, and we should be ready for a deeper drop here as well. So this will be, it could be some greater downward action. So that's why this consolidation is important. That's why this grabber is also is important. So that's approximately the balance uh, that we have on the gold market right now. So you could make your own decision what you, what side you will follow, what trade you could uh, take. So actually I see only two possible uh, scenarios. First is relying on the total on the grabber with the placing stop somewhere below it using this grabber candle as an entry for new position and hope that market will hit this area in 1524. For the bears, uh, you need to wait uh, the opposite scenario. So if market will erase this consolidation, break the support and showing the collapse, that will be your time to think about this and where you could step in. But currently why market keep this tendency forming the grabber, well, it's not time for taking the short position by far.